Promike group committing crimes against humanity liable for persecution at Hilk Coalition speaks. They condemn use of explosives and bombs against OpenNet. The Coalition for Human Rights Advocacy in Africa, CHRADA, has condemned the recent attack on the office of the Action People's Party, APP, in Port Harcourt, River State, allegedly perpetrated by a pro nissim wiki group. In a statement signed by Dr. Joyce Anderson Idapo, CHRADA, CRADA, an international organization based in the United Kingdom, described it as a clear attempt to disrupt the local government election process and undermine democracy. The center expressed outrage over the use of explosive and bombs against opponents, which is said demonstrate a blatant disregard for human life and a callous willingness to use violence to achieve political goals. CHRADA Crada noted that this is not an isolated incident, as the same group of politicians have previously used explosives to bomb public buildings and persons during a supposed political event in Port Harcourt. These actions demonstrate a blatant disregard for human life and a callous willingness to use violence to achieve political goals, the statement said. The use of explosive bombs against the opponent is a serious violation of human rights and international law. Crowder believes that the pro wiki group is liable for prosecution at the International Criminal Court in Hague for these atrocities. We will not stand only, we will not stand idly. Crowder believes that a pro wiki group is liable for prosecution at the International Criminal Court in Hague for these atrocities. We will not stand idly by while innocent lives are lost and democratic processes are undermined. The center is deeply concerned about the escalating violence in River State and its impact on the civilian population. Women and children are disproportionately affected by these attacks and it is our duty to protect them. We urge the Nigerian government to take immediate action to protect its citizens and hold perpetrators accountable. CHRADA Crada therefore calls on the international community to take notice of these crimes against humanity and support efforts to bring those responsible to justice. It warned that the recent resort to use of non-state actors to perpetrate violent crimes only possible in war situation will spell doom for the all rich Niger for the all rich Niger Delta region if not tamed by authorities. Quoting from Common Article 3 of the 1949 Geneva Conventions, the center said the law prohibits violence to life and person, in particular murder of all kinds, mutilation, cruel treatment and torture. The statement added, we will continue to advocate for the right of victims and push for accountability no matter how long it takes. The pro group must be held accountable for their actions. We demand that they cease the violent behavior immediately and engage in peaceful political discourse. Failure to do so will result in crowd advocating for the prosecution at the ICC. Furthermore, we warn that the recent resort to use of non-state actors to perpetrate violent crimes only possible in a war situation will spell doom for the oil rich Niger Delta region if not tamed by the authorities. The lack of prosecution of the culprit is another dangerous law for the Tenembo administration effort to tame terrorism in the northeast, northwest, and part of the south. If left unchecked, this trend will not only undermine the legitimacy of the government but also embolden all the groups to adopt similar tactics, leading to a breakdown of law and order and a potential descent into chaos. We ask the government to take immediate and decisive action to address the situation, bring perpetrators to justice and restore peace and stability to the region. And I ask this question, what thing happened? Kilde, what's the problem? What's the matter? It don't make sense, you. As in, when I mean it don't make sense, I mean the Katakata way for River States. I've been saying this thing before this protest, if you see the kind of wahala, the kind of breeze where they blew for River States, that breeze where they blew no better breeze. And I don't know why, it's not I don't, I don't know why. I know why the government, most especially the government at the center, that is federal government, don't refuse to put much inside this thing so that 
before this thing go turn another wahala ready for south. How Boko Haram you start making a no forget. Now so small, 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 it turn before you know it, it become fully blown. If I go turn to matter will be said and go need to they do a uh, call state of emergency for which I know she's not waiting they want. Before I go turn that matter, why not make everybody bury the hatchet? It don't do. Okay, yes, you help somebody reach somewhere. Intel, you say no need your help again. Why not wait till 2027? Abby, rest till 2027. You say you don't go rest. You say you won't make sure, say make a mistake. That means say you don't even care. The people of River State, they don't mean anything to now. You know, what are they pity for? Now, you know, people of River State, maybe say they, they most especially political talk where they serve these people. And I see in a life outside. And I see in a life outside. And I see in a life outside. Make person where we say, nobody say the man they I do. I go say, okay, now border, now they kill her. This one, you know, they I do. In the for FCT, where we say, in the collect money. Body one will be saying, in salary. Body one will enter in pocket through embezzlement. If they collect them. Then you know, allow and make in the use owner. They destabilize that. And I know she said, I had no collect. So this matter, before you go enter, be careful matter. Before you go pass, be careful. Make them do it in. Make everybody, eh? Make everybody mind come down. You don't need to reach like this now. You don't need to reach like this. Eh? They will do more now that the court has given them the power of how to be care. They are no longer in control. They will do more harm to the state to attract public disorder, which then which would then call for state of emergency. I know some of which they want, but haba. Like now, like it's not making sense to me that I am a member of a particular state and because of which I want, I can't want to set my state on fire. No, you say now only that state I get to. I don't get an other person's state, not be your state. That place where you day, where your house day, where your people day. Now be your own place. Why you want to set up a place? Because of which they look how much. Wicked would destroy APC and run back to PDP. Just go and mark it. Do you think so? Wicked is extremely desperate. As long as whatever he represents is for APC, he's above all. Exactly. He also wants state of emergency in River State. Wicked should be arrested. Like, like I told you now. Now, because federal government gets, you can get sheer inside this matter. They get concerned. They want capture River State, make River State, make it also be, say, the governor for 2027. But they don't care what happened to anybody. They don't care if somebody dies in the process. They don't care. The bomb and explosive that were used for the state assembly complex, the explosive that detonated at the rally in Port Harcourt, in which the handler lost his limbs, the same group bombed the APP office. God is exposing the enemies of the state. Okay, oh, well, all right, on this note, we have come to the end of the news. We say thank you for tuning in to listen until I come your way next time. Enjoy the rest of your day.